Hey Sensi friends, it's Ramona, your independent Sensi consultant. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today we're gonna to talk about a Sensi haul I did. And yes, I do have a headband in. I'm trying yet again, many, many times over to try to grow my hair out again. So you may see this more in the future. But anyway, bear with me. Growing my hair out is not an easy task and I always lose patience and get it chopped off. So we'll see how far I get this time. Anyway. Okay, so one of the things I did purchase is in the new spring summer catalog, in the specials category, there are some curated bundles that Sensi has chosen for us. And one of them, I've just immediately forgot the name. I think it's a sensational um, bundle and it comes with 10 cents. And I'm not going to talk about them right now because I'm going to do some sniffing, a sniffing video with a friend. So we're going to save those for another day. So other than that, um, one of the things I did get was the Butt First Coffee Warmer. And it's like a big coffee mug. It is quite a large coffee mug. It is an element warmer. It's eight watts and um sensi logo on off light button and it's kind of old like an old tin mug like i know my grandfather um had a tin mug like this he also and it kind of i believe it was red and white red and white sticks out for some reason anyway so it looks like it's old distressed and i thought it was just really great and it's going to go on my coffee bar next to my Keurig and things like that. So I'm really excited about this. I'm not going to plug it in because it doesn't light up, obviously. So that, and when we finish here, we'll be going outside. The other warmer I got, which we're not going to talk about because I'm going to give this a, a, its own video, is the Charitable Cause Warmer. So every new catalog season, Sensi offers a Charitable Cause Warmer that might go to any number of different charities. We'll talk about this one when I do it. Um, and they donate a proceeds of the a portion of the proceeds to sale of the sales to that cause. Um, and so this one is called the Blossom Warmer, and I've posted pictures on it. You can go online, see lots of pictures on my website, and then if you just Google it or go to Pinterest and plug in Sensi Blossom Warmer, you'll see it. It's extremely gorgeous. I love it. I love the cause. Um, and so we are going to talk about that uh, early in the week, and then that. Is going to go on my little table over there and replace the I think it's called the woodland warmer but I could be wrong about that I'm probably am okay so that takes care of that so then for the rest we have I did get one of the Scentsy room sprays in the new formula pinkberry sandalwood and I did get another one in the whiff box uh magnolia linen and so one of these will be going in uh the restroom and i also pulled an old one out um this one's in shoreline drive the packaging is different but not only is the packaging different the formulation is different because so many people had concerns about the oil-based formula when they spray it in the air it gets on the floor it gets a little bit slippy so they now have made it a water-based formula and i'm just trying to figure out how I can show you the difference. And originally um, I had sprayed them. Well, I guess actually this might show a little bit. Maybe it might be hard to tell. Yeah, yeah, it is kind of hard to tell. I took each one, I sprayed it on a piece of white paper to see what kind of residue it would leave. But now this is a couple of days old because I didn't get back to it. So I think you can kind of tell there's an oily residue there. Can you see that? And then down here is where the water-based one is and it's pretty clean down there. So that might be a demonstration. I maybe can think of something better to, to, to do that demonstration with, but for now, uh, just know that this is a new formula, water-based, not oil-based. So I'm really excited about that. So Pinkberry Sandalwood, which you just talked about because it's one of the new scents in the catalog, Pinkberry and Fresh Cherry and a sweet pop to Tonka Bean and Sandalwood. And for the wax, in the wax bar, I know I did get some fruitness from the berry and cherry and the sandalwood. So I'm, I'm guessing it'd be the same here. Oh, hi, Stella. Oh yeah, that's good. Now in this, I get a little more cherry than in the wax. What the heck is going on there? 
My computer has a mind of its own, that's all I can say. Okay, then I got the new, 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 new Scentsy Swipes. So these are like the Clorox wipes, but they're Scentsy. And the scent is uh, um, Squeeze the Day. One of my favorite scents in lemon scents. I love mostly everything lemon. And this one is Tart and True Fragrance of Pure Lemons Balanced by a Hint of Vanilla Cream. I like this. This, so lemon categories, my lemon categories in my own head are cleaner lemon, fresh juicy citrus lemon, bakery lemon, I guess, I don't know if there's anything else you could kind of subcategorize lemon into. This I categorize in the clean lemon. So if you like cleaning products that smell like lemon, like I do, make sure kitchen or wherever smells super clean, um, you're gonna like these. I haven't tried them yet, I just opened the box, but um, surface cleaning wipes. Uh, can be used on non-porous surfaces, open lid and pull, we all know how to do that. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, so I'm really looking forward to uh, checking those out. Um, and then I got um, the new scent in laundry products, which is wildflower cotton. I got the small whiffs and the laundry liquid. And in also in last month's whiff box, there was the wildflower cotton Scentsy Fresh. So I know what it smells like, and I know it smells good, and I like it. Zesty lemon and wildflowers brighten line dried cotton among sun kissed woods. So, um, let me just spray it here actually. Um, I got a space. So, I definitely get lemon and a light floral. Not so much if I'm getting wild, uh, sun kissed woods but definitely getting uh, the lemon and wildflowers. And it's really, really nice. So I definitely am glad I bought that. Um, so it comes in the small washer whisks, the large washer whisks, the, wa the laundry liquid, the dryer discs, and I don't know if it's in the Scentsy Fresh online or if that was just a special in the whip box. I have to check on that. But anyway, it's good. Then, where are we at here? We talked about this, we talked about that, we talked about that. One, two, three. And then finally, um, which I'm going to be melting for you this week and talking about later in the week, the Mother's Day collection. This is the packaging. And on the inside are the three bars. Super nice, like that. And courage, kindness, and strength. And so on the front it says, she is. Courage, kindness, and strength. Courage is bold raspberry and red mango leap into pink amber. Interesting, I've never seen anything called pink amber ever. Uh, kindness is dewy greens uplift enduring notes of magnolia and white musk. And strength, nectarine sweetens fresh pineapple with a gentle touch of sun-kissed lemon. So if you're a fruit person, that's really gonna be nice. So as I said, I will be melting these this week. In fact, I'll probably put one in when we're done here. And um, I'll be back to you in a couple of days with my thoughts on that. So I believe that is everything. Um, so I hope everybody's having a fantastic weekend. And I'm just going to give you a little hint of a spoiler alert. If you're a Harry Potter fan, you want to be stay tuned. Uh, this week we'll be making some announcements about what's coming up very soon for Harry Potter collectors. You don't want to miss it. That's all I can say about that. All right. Have a great day and I'll see you soon. Bye.